Well, hello everyone. Thank you for joining me here once again at Fluid Arts by Elsa. We're gonna get ready to dive into our next video. Before we do that, I do wanna show you two paintings that have dried um, from my previous videos. I showed you the neutral colors. Um, when it was still a little wet, I wanna show you now that it's dry completely. So here she is. And look how beautiful it turned out. I am absolutely happy with the way this color palette turned out against the white background. Very, very beautiful. Tell me what you think about it and look how it shines. See that? Beautiful. And I'm gonna top coat it with resin. Let me know if you're interested in this piece. Both will be available for purchase, just email me at elsasgallery at gmail.com. The next piece is the one from my previous video and it has dried beautifully as well. Take a look at this beauty. She is rich, love the composition, a little different for uh, from me, but I wanna embellish this one and see how she turns out. But look at how beautiful the colors are love that richness of the permanent rose by Windsor and Newton absolutely gore a gorgeous piece so that one is also available for purchase so today I'm going to show you the base color of the painting that we're going to go ahead to uh, do today but I don't have an idea as to what this color is so I don't I can't answer that for you but look how beautiful it is this paint that I collected from my table, it's like a shade of a smoky blue or something to that um, effect. So I am gonna go ahead, flood my canvas, and then we'll go ahead with the colors, which is interesting. And I don't know how it's gonna work against the blue, but we're gonna go ahead and um, dive into it anyway. So without further ado, meet me down at the canvas. Okay. So the canvas has been flooded. Now we're gonna go ahead and layer our colors in. Let me just bring this light a little closer and better. Okay, so I am going to be starting with, let's see, let's, let's torch out the air bubbles first. A few air bubbles. Okay, so we are going to be starting with Van Dyke Brown by Amsterdam. So we're going to go ahead here. We're going to go out here. So we're going for a minimal negative space. Our next color is going to be Thalo Green by Windsor and Newton. Next color we have here, Warm Gray by Amsterdam. Look at the color. It is a pretty color. Let me see. Mm. 
Next we have Pearl Deep Brown by Arteza. Okay. And last we have Pearl Copper Gold by Arteza. This is interesting. Definitely an interesting color palette. I'm going to move them out of the way. We're going to torch out our air bubbles. <clears throat> and we are going to begin. Wow, what a beautiful piece. I love it. I love it. I do want to take some of this to continue this line right over here. I'm just connecting my lines here. I'm going to blow it in here a bit. Okay, guys, I don't think there's anything I want to do here. I'm going to just go ahead and clean out, uh, clean out my edges, and I'll bring you in for a close-up. We'll be right back. Okay, everyone, so here it is, and look how gorgeous it is. I'm going to turn on my flash. Look how beautiful. I love that green and brown. Look how beautiful it looks. Gorgeous petals. A lot of cells, large cells, 
as you can see. Love that copper at the top. Look how beautiful. Absolutely a gorgeous piece. Tell me what you guys think. I love the cells. I am getting a lot of cells, and that is due to the Flow Acrylic White by um, Artist Loft that I have put on here and mixed with that blue. Um, so that's why you're seeing all this white cells, but that's okay, because I'll show you how I fix that. Other than that, I love the blowout. I love the motion that the painting has. Tell me what you think. I love the color combination and I love the splashes of brown. They kind of like branch out in different directions as I blew it out. I love how it looks. Leave a comment in the comment section below. Thank you for watching Fluid Arts by Elsa. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate your support. Thank you so much. I'll see you in the next painting or my next video. Bye.